Yes, 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 you man. Self improvement Sunday. You already know who you got in the cut. We're back. The new Macs already come through the, the high quality sounds because we're really trying to be number one out here. And funny oh, enough, man. that what does that link nicely into, bro? Bro, the video about today is about why you should be number one in life in anything, bro. In anything, bro. Why should in your sector, in your sector, in your area, you should aim to be the best. You can't be number two. I don't know what fuck number two means. I wouldn't be one of number one. I'm obsessed, bro. This is about, bro. This is what I'm gonna tell you. Today's video is about why you should be obsessed with being number one. In your mind, you have to think you're the best to become the best. You know what I'm saying, bro? I hear that. I hear that. And explain to them. Bro, explain to them where it comes from. Where, where, where does it come from? Where does it come from? The mentality or yeah, like, the mentality, uh, the mentality. Mentality. What personal or like influence? Influence, influence, influence. What, what, what Always. made you? What, yeah, like what, what, took, what brought you to there? Brought me to there is because, man, bro, since young and I just always had like, like healthy self-discipline levels. Being around a very healthy environment, my father, um, I knew what, knew what, knew what I wanted. Like hunger was there, and just, I think the main reason right now, man, them is Cristiano, fucking Ronaldo, bro. That down there is the definition of obsession in being number one. Being number one, bro. Big man thing, bro. Like, that influence that guy's had on me is crazy. Crazy, 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 crazy. Oh my god, fam. This guy, his interviews, everything. Oh. You guys need to understand, man. This man right here, like. Yes, my, bro, you know, man, love for the subscription. Love for the subscription, my guy. Sorry to interrupt you, bro. But love for the subscription. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hope you enjoy your stay. You came out, bro. You scammed that a good time, bro. You're in the video. And now you're hearing this TT advice from bro. Oh, yeah, let's get back to it. Let's get back to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, speaking about obsession, man, this man right here, fam, he's obsessed with being the best. And he is the best. Like, he is the fucking best. Fam. Like, maybe you know, Messi's better. I'm talented, but I don't really believe in talent like that, bro. I believe in hard work, bro. I don't, I don't know what talent is, bro. Everyone has natural talent, bro. But you get outworked, bro. This guy, like, this guy has such a massive influence on me, like, in terms of. Becoming the best, sacrificing, knowing what you want, like, you know, you have to lose to win, it's crazy, but forget talking about him for a minute, let's just talk about how you guys should benefit from this mentality, because that's what the aim of the video here is, self-improvement fucking Sunday, after this video, you should feel some type of way, and that's what I'm here for, that's my job, you hear what I'm saying, you guys need to understand that, like, let's just break it down, in your area, whatever you do in life that you like or something like that, you have not passion, but you put time and effort into it. Like maybe not that much, but you you want to get results. You feel good about yourself. But why? Why? Example, why, this, why? This could be gym, something like gym, maybe a little Sunday Sunday league team, something like that. That's yeah, it's yeah, a yeah. It's a start off on something you enjoy. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause... And then you realize to yourself that you're doing well, but I'm not the best though. So what's the point? It's still good to do well, but in your mind, you always have to think you're the best. Because if you don't think you're the best, you will never become the best. Because becoming the best requires sacrifice and dedication, hard work. It's not even hard, like, it's more than hard work. You have to become obsessed, like, you have to really, really outwork people, bro. Like, you, you won't get anywhere in love about sacrifice. If you haven't sacrificed a single thing, I'm not talking about sacrificing, like, basically, like, crap, G. I'm talking about really sacrificing things you could have done, like, the next best alternative, like, it's crazy. You have to really sacrifice to win. Like, you have to become the best because if you don't, you won't work like the best. Like, how do you feel other people are doing better than in the same position as you? Like, it's crazy. I don't understand how people like allow that to happen to themselves. Like, what the fuck? Like, why the fuck am I losing? Like, why the fuck am I number two? Like, number two sounds so fucking wet. Like, bro, imagine being saying, "Oh yeah, um, I'm number two. And that's so shit, bro. Like, hundred, hundred, hundred. You Think about the best people in every in their in their sector and anything, bro. But sports is the easy example to use. If you ask any of them, who's even if you ask, bro, even if you ask Messi, who's the best football player in the world, who do you think he would say, bro? Who do you think he would so, say? Ronaldo. Easy. Nah, bro, you, bro, Messi's a winner as well, you know, mums. I think yeah, Messi would Messi say him brother. instantly. Oh yeah, you obviously you will say him instantly. He's just as obsessed as Ronaldo. Actually, I just ah. just as a stretch, just as a stretch. I can yeah, give you that. Yeah, I can give you that. You got to rewind that. You got to rewind that. Uh, this guy, uh, I'm, I'm not, I'm not having a whole side topic debate on stream right now. <laughs> but fucking hear me out. You have to like, like, can't stress you guys enough. Like, once you start thinking I'm the best, 
And who the fuck is this guy? Like, he might, he might be doing his thing in class studying this and that. I might be fucking around this and that. But I'm out working. I'm better. I know I'm better. Like, I'm better. Like, he, I don't care. I don't give a fuck. He can think he's better than me. I know I'm better. That's how you have to think. You have to think you're the best. If you don't think you're the best, you're already lost. It's all mental. Everything in life is a mental game. You have to believe you're the winner. I'm the man. I'm the fucking shit. I'm the good looking man. I'm the fucking guy, bro. I'm fucking Ams. You're fucking MKM, bro. But that, that's what your thought should be. Like, when you're just walking in, walking into the room, any room, you should always be thinking, whatever you're doing, you should always be thinking, I'm the fucking best. I'm the coldest. When you're linking a girl, she's lucky to be with me, to be within like, my like, presence, bro. That. Fucking the king. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, bro. If you act like you're the best, you get cheated that way, bro. Mm. People Facts, that, bro. bro people that move half-hearted get cheated half-hearted. Do you want some half-hearted treatment, bro? Mums, bro. So if you sacrifice the whole thing, you get a whole reward, bro. Yeah, exactly. So if you put, let me just basically, it comes down to one simple principle as well. Um, you don't don't expect big things. Like you guys need to understand this. Like if you expect, yeah, let's just say, uh, let's just talk about A levels or GCSE. If you expect you're gonna get an A, but you know you haven't worked like an A student. You haven't put 110 percent in there. Don't don't be expecting these results, fam. Because you only get what you put in. Like there's no there's no secret crap. There's no magical formula. There's no book. There's no nothing. There's no there's no fucking like magical um, speech. Or nothing like that. It's just, I agree as well. Yeah. Messi has more talent. Ronaldo has the drive. That's exactly. Bro, when I was in school, bro, bonus as well, like, we, were, like, we wasn't heavily talented, bro. Man knows my natural talent, but I don't believe in that shit, bro, because I believe in myself massively. That's delusional, bro. We know about being deluded, fam. You guys need to be deluded, bro, in self belief. Like, you guys need to know that, like, someone thinks you need to... Wait, let me reword this. Someone needs to think, yeah. Someone needs to think they got the better of you or something like that. Like, let, people, people always think they got the better of you. When it comes down to achievements and execution, I'm always going to be the best. I can't lose. I, don't, I refuse to lose. This is what your thoughts are like. And I'm not afraid of failure. I'm not going to fail. I'm, but if I fail, of course I'm going to be fucking vexed. It is what it is. Like, that's what it is. When you fail, it is what it is. If that's the mentality. Then you just 10 you times harder. You've got to you turn it into a lesson. you got to learn from it. Yeah, 100, 100, Bro. 100. Never be afraid of failure. Though, because failure will happen in life. You have to lose to win. Yeah, you for real, for real. Win. Everyone takes L's. Them L's, them L's are, can be the biggest W's of your life, bro. And, mm-hmm. bro, I'm going to live by this to the end. You miss every shot you don't take. Mm-hmm. 100, 100. <laughs> and, like, speaking about, like, any ballers on here right now, any, like, YouTubers or any person that wants to do social media or any person that wants to be the best in their maths class, smash everybody. Um, I don't know, best in gym. I don't know, best in finances. In anything, just believe in yourself. People won't believe in people. People always have some crap to say, fam. Like, it's weird. There'll always be that one pussy on there to try to de-humble you or try to give you excuses or you tell them a win. You just look them in the eyes and you say, I'm better than you. Like, you can say what you want. You can say what you want, but I'm a serial winner. It's facts. Me and bro here right now, I'm times MKM, we are serial winners. We are, there's only one guy that I can really say, two guys, one of them, uh, I won't mention which people, TT23 is a very, very, very serial winner as well. 100%, 100%, all of us, bro. He's a, he's like, a fucking serial winner, all of us. You guys don't know, when, when me, um, I'm times MK and times TT23, you guys need to be there for that fucking day, I'm telling you guys now. When you, when serial winners talk, Link up of a lifetime. Listen. Huh? Link up of a lifetime, bro. 100, 100, you guys are gonna fucking love this. I'm telling you this now, it's in the making, it's in the making. Bro, let me tell you something right now, yeah. If you're not fucking obsessed, then don't do it. I really believe that. If you're not obsessed with becoming the best, don't do it because you're not gonna be happy. Right now, somebody asked me, am I happy? Bro, I'm healthy, bro. God willing, everything's going right. Like, I want more and more and more. I'm never satisfied because I want more. I'm obsessed. You can't outwork me. People, like, you have to think like this because people are. Bro, I can't stress you guys I, right I, now. I, I, you I, have to be yeah. able to win. Yeah, we're back, we're back, we're back. Say nothing, say nothing, say nothing, Technical say difficulty, nothing. but we're straight back in. Man like Yusuf, why are you telling me? Welcome, welcome. Come out, a great time, mid-video. Yusuf, you're getting a shout out right now, bro. I don't know what you did before you came into this video, but hopefully this changes your life, whatever. If you. I don't know, like, I don't care if it, if it isn't, I, I, do, I really, really hope it actually helps you because this is why I'm here for, this is my job. Um, Fucking hell, man! Like, don't do something if you don't want to become the best and don't want to be obsessed with it. Because don't expect results, even if you're putting hours and hours of work. Don't don't think you're gonna get some results like that, like that, some fucking magician. It doesn't work like that, fam. It doesn't work like that. Even if when you're grinding so hard, so hard, you're always gonna dip like one cryptocurrency, even dip more, but your value is going up. 
For real. Achievements on paper or financial in your bank, but at least you're training your mind. Your, your mind's worth. Eyebrow. Your self worth. Your self worth. You might not your be going up eyebrow. in assets, but your body, your mind, everything. Yeah, you, yeah. you are upgrading. You're elevating. Yeah, you, you, at yeah, the exactly. same time. Every time you persevere, well, that's a whole new new barrier broken for next time that you can easily it's a whole new level you can get back to whenever you need to because mm. mm. your mind's eyeball your biggest enemy your most self-destructive weapon always the most resourceful tool of all time like you have to understand everything in life's mental like you know in your heart like deep down who you are really behind closed doors but no one's looking and and you, everybody can put a facade up like don't fuck around like just look really really look in the mirror and say to yourself like, am i winning like, am i doing something that's striving to my goals am i am i some fucking bum what am i doing like what am i actually doing in my life like you guys need to look yourself in the mirror like i'm i'm doing well at this thing but i'm not where i want to be but you're not where you're not where you want to be because you're not fucking putting the hours in what are you sacrificing like, don't just go out there and sacrifice a fucking girl or something or sacrifice your time spending with your mum or something like that but sacrifices come naturally you have to make a choice in your mind you need to learn to say no learning to say no increases your obsession and your craft I can't stress enough you guys you need to understand the power of hard work and the power of self-discipline because trust me it's never about in school it's never about oh who's going to work most work in the class and all of that who's getting the best results or whatever in no no best results say that back that was wrong that was wrong that was wrong um, about who's focusing in class, doing the work, doing the teacher's pet, whatever. I always, I always respect that, I always have respect for that. But at the end of the day, when it comes down to it, even if you're fucking around, you're the man in school, like, terrorize the whole school, your guys, and like, you need to do that, by the way. Like, you need to fucking know that at the end of the day, yeah, you know what? These guys can think they're the, the best. But when it comes to results time, and when it's time to execute, I'm the man. I'm the fucking best. This is too easy for me. Like, before you go on an exam, you already know how well you're going to do. Honestly, there's only one thing that can really stop you in the exam. Maybe, like, there is off days, like, the paper wasn't good, but I don't really believe in that shit, fam. If you do every past paper, whatever, bullshit, whatever, all that stuff, like, correctly, you already know how you're going to do an exam. If you had mocks two weeks ago before your, I should say, before your GCSEs, and you didn't get, um, uh, I don't know, 90%, 80%, if you didn't get A star weights, don't expect you in two weeks you're going to get A stars, because it doesn't work like that, fam. It doesn't work like that. You have to be the best. Before an exam, you have to be confident. Forget about confidence and arrogance. Self-confidence is the best thing. So they ask you, bro, how are you going to do an exam? Like, never never, never be arrogant. Be like, yeah, I'm going to be cold, bro. Like, especially, be, especially to people who don't know. Because evil eyes are a massive thing. But in your mind, you know, oh yeah, I was going to go on the exam, I'm going to handle it. I'm going to handle it. I going to go out the exam, come in, handle it, and I'm off. Next task, next task. Because you have to believe. You have to be very, very, very to believe in yourself for you. Because you know what? People are going to drag you down. People are always going to try to put you to their level, whatever. But at the end of the day, when that door closes, you know what you need to do. You need to handle business and enjoy your life. That's what you got to do. Business first, then pleasure. Always. 100%. 100%. BBD came at a perfect time. Ready for video two, bro. Everyone on YouTube, thank you for watching. This has been Self Improvement Sunday. This has been me and Afaha. Love for watching. We'll see you, man, next week, Sunday, 8 p.m. Be there. Be there.